Hey everyone, welcome to my channel or welcome back if you're not new. My name is Michelle and for today's video, I wanted to do an updated review on the Saint Laurent coffee mug. I have had this one since the beginning of this year and I wanted to share my experience this far just in case you were looking to get a new coffee mug for the fall and winter time. I know this is a lot of money to spend on a mug so let me tell you about this mug before you spend $125 on this mug. Okay, so this is a very, a very simple mug. Basically, this one is all black and then it has Saint Laurent in white and the Saint Laurent is actually holding up very well. I think there's only like one part where, um, or two parts actually, where I guess like you can see the paint coming off. I don't know if you can see it on the A and the T. Wait, what was it? Actually, sorry, the U and the T in Laurent. So that's the only place, but honestly, when you look at it from afar, it still looks very good. This mug is very easy to clean and all of it is still all black. Um, let me show you a quick close-up so you can see. If my camera would like to focus. There we go. So yeah, the mug itself is very easy to clean. And the lid, on the other hand, is a different story. I would definitely say that this is probably my least favorite part about the mug. It's a silicone lid, and as you can see, like, it's um, dried now, but um, I did use this earlier, and it's, I don't know, it's just something about it I just don't like. Um, and I wish that was the only thing that was different about this mug. Um, because, yeah, especially when I'm, like, wearing lipstick, I kind of find it hard to clean. Um, but, yeah. It also isn't the most secure. As you can see, it just acts as, like, a little suction. Um, so, this one time, actually, when I had this cup in my handbag, and I don't remember if it was full or not. I think it was probably empty. Um, but, um, I had this in my handbag, and then I went to go grab my drink. I only had my hand on the lid. And it actually slipped off <laughs> and dropped into, like, my handbag. Um, luckily, it, I, yeah, there, I don't think there was anything in it at the time. Um, but, yeah, it literally slipped off. And that would have been a, such a... I don't know. I would have been so devastated if, like, that was full and everything just spilled into my handbag um but yeah so i learned my lesson to always grab it from the actual mug especially if i'm grabbing from the top so that um that won't ever ever happen again also recommended just to carry it by the actual mug itself um so that you don't have any problems with the lid accidentally coming off because yeah that would have been so sad <laughs> so as far as this cup, I do drink hot and cold drinks from it. Let's start with hot. So whenever I drink hot drinks in here, usually it's coffee. Um, I do find that the mug itself does get hot. So sometimes like it's hard to hold because the drink inside is hot. So the mug also is getting hot. I also notice that drinks don't stay hot for a very long time in this mug. Um, so if you are a slow coffee drinker, this probably isn't for you. Luckily for me, I like to drink my drinks fast, so it really doesn't uh, pose a problem for me. Um, as far as like iced drinks or cold drinks, um, if your drink is very cold, it will condensate on the outside of the mug. And so if you don't have like a coaster on it, um, the table or whatever it may be is going to get wet because it does get wet on the outside. But yeah, overall, I really do like this mug. I feel like there's just something about it, like when I am drinking from it or using it, that makes me feel um, a little bit different. There is quite a um, a bit weight to this mug. Um, I think I weighed it one time and it was over one pound. Um, so yeah, just know that it's not easy to knock over if it's like on the table or something because there is a bit of weight to this mug also. As I'm now making this video, I did notice that the price now for this mug is $125. It used to be $95 at the beginning of this year. Um, but yeah, I, I feel like this is a great mug and if you do drink coffee a lot, you might use it every day and yeah so in that case the cost per wear would be very reasonable 
And yeah, I think that's it for today's video. Let me know if you have any other questions about the Saint Laurent coffee mug in ceramic. I'll be happy to answer them in the comments below. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.